G'day, my name is Garth, and this is the third video in the series of how to set up your free plus shipping rates in Shopify. So if you haven't seen the first and second, go back and watch those um, because they relate to this one here. So the first thing I talk about is the shipping table, which you've seen before. So this would be slightly different depending on which country you're in. At the moment, I'm in Australia, so I've got Australia, and I'm using metric, which is kilos. If you're in the US, it'll say US and you will have pounds instead of kilos. The difference is it will be 0 0.1 pound instead of 0 0.1 kilo. And here where you've got one kilo, it'll be one pound. So I've got a table um, in the previous video that actually have got all these, or you can just stop, uh, pause the video and have a quick look at these. So that's the shipping rates that we're using. We're not using the rest of the world. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna look at is the, how you would set up the products. And then we'll go through some examples of how that works. So with the products, we've got three products at the moment. So we've got like a free plus shipping offer. We've got the normal uh, product, which is not free. And also we have a, a related third product here. So let's have a look of how you would set up the, the free um, foam roller, for example, that we're selling in this one. So these are products, pretty simple. All I've done is given a title and we've put one image in there. The pricing we put at zero and the compare to price we put at the normal price that product would be. We don't charge taxes here so we take that out. Tick the box that says require shipping. Currently we're not tracking inventory but if you're using, uh, if you do have inventory you would put that in or if you're using Obelo you would let that Obelo track it. Most important thing is, is because this is a free product we set the weight to one kilo or in the states would be one pound and this has no variance. If you do have products with variance, you've got to make sure that the weight is one kilo for each of the variants. So once you've added in a product like that, for example, then we go to and have a quick look at what a, a normal product would look like, which is the foam roller without being free. So as you can see, we've got the foam roller, same picture, difference is it's $29.95. We're doing uh, shipping and the weight you'll notice is 0 0.1. In my case, it's 0 0.1 kilos. It's metric, but in your case, in the States, it might be 0 0.1 pound. So we have the same setup except it's 0.1. Okay, so that's for normal standard products is 0.1. And then we have a look at a related product, the yoga mat. And because it's a, st a standard product, we're not doing free shipping on it. We've got the pricing. We've got to compare pricing so saved about ten dollars and we got it at 0 0.1 as well okay so now that we've sh you can see how the the products are set up let's work through an example of what will happen when a customer comes in so they'll come in and they'll when they'll land on your page most likely be advertising just the the free plus shipping offer so you'll have the offer here you'll have some text here and they'll go add to cart <coughs> So then once I've got it in here, they'll just check out. 99% of people, this is what they'll do. They'll just check out here. And it will go to customer information. They'll put the customer information in and then it will go to shipping method, which is the screen you see now. Now, as you can see, it's got standard shipping of $9.95. Okay, so we've got zero for the product, $9.95. And where does this come from? This comes from the shipping table. Because it's a free plus shipping offer, it falls into the one kilo at 9.95, and that's what we want. So that's, and then they would continue the payment method and check out. Now let's say for example, they do something different. Let's say they continue shopping and buy something else, which is what you wanna do. And on your page, you might have related items, and so uh, they might select something else. So they go continue shopping, and they go, you know what, I want that yoga mat for $39.95, that looks sweet. So we're gonna click on add to cart. And this will have their one free plus shipping offer they came in originally, plus one extra. So now we're getting, we're not making too much money out of that, but we're actually making good money out of that. So then they go to checkout. And this time they're being charged $17.95. So how this works is that the foam roller is set at one kilo or one pound and the yoga mat is at 0.1 kilo or 0.1 pound. So it is either 1.1 kilos total or 1.1 pound in total. So when we look at our rates again, 
one kilo or one pound is what you would see is 9.95 but we're not getting charged 9.95 we're getting charged 17.95 and the reason is that when it's 1.1 it will jump up to the next level which is two kilo at 17 dollars 95 as you can see that there okay so now we go back to our cart let's pretend that uh, instead of the uh, one roller let's assume that they get two so that we go to checkout and they'll be charged $24.95. We'll go back again. So as they keep increasing this to three, now they're getting charged $32.95. And then we go to four, $38.95. And they might still be happy with this and are thinking, well, I might actually get some more of those foam rollers. That'd be great. So they go, well, you know, I'm going to get five. They go to check out this time. And this time you'll notice it says there is no shipping methods available for your card or destination. And they will not, as you can see, it's grayed out. They cannot continue to check out. And the reason for that is because we've set the free items, these free foam ro rollers, we've set at one kilo each. And because now, or, or one pound each. So therefore, it's five kilo or five pound, which means that we've hit our limit because in our shipping, five kilo is the highest we go to, or if you're in the States, it'd be five pound, 38.95. And because they purchased five of those plus one yoga mat, the weight would be the 5.1 pound or 5.1 kilo, which would put it over that limit of 39.5. Uh, 30, 38.95 and because it's over that amount that's the reason why when they try and check out they won't be able to check out because it's outside the weight range so you'll never have anyone coming in and buying any more than what you've uh, set up in the system in this case it's five so this gives you an example you might say well hey I, I might want them to buy more than five and that's fine you can adjust it but as long as you understand how the, the table works and you might say, well, I'm, I might want them to buy more than one item. I might, um, they might want to buy two yoga mats or something like that. And that's fine. They can do that if they're only got maybe one, two or three of the free offers. But you could write in your text that they only get one, two or three of the free plus shipping offers. And then if they choose to do something else, they can do that. So that's, that's how you set that up. And uh, it's pretty straightforward. So you can't get done uh, for, they basically cannot check out with these free items. They can't put a hundred in there and check out and you're going to lose. Um, so that, because that's a, a lot of the problems with the other free plus shipping methods. Um, they used apps and they use different things. But this covers most of the things. And most people honestly will come in, get a free item. If you specify that they can get maybe three or four items, they'll do that as well. And some of the people will come in, get the free item, and then choose a, another related item. And that's really what you want them to do. You want them to get another product as well. Um, so that should give you an idea of how to do the cart. And as I said, the most important thing is the shipping tables and to understand that your, um, your normal shipping is set at point one and your free plus shipping the free items you're going to do at these weights and make sure it's set up that way. And that's basically how it works. So if you've, uh, I think I've covered everything in that. I think, yep, that's it. So if you've got any questions, uh, please put them down below and I will help you out. But don't forget, have a look at number one, two, and this video, and this one uh, covers everything. I think I've covered everything for this topic. So with this method, you won't have to pay for any apps and you'll be able to get set up straight away and start doing free plus shipping offers. All right, see you tomorrow. Bye.